U.S. rejected Armenia's allegations of ethnic cleansing of Armenians in Azerbaijani Karabakh. We are in touch with contacts on the ground about the situation. We won't shy away from taking appropriate actions to respond to allegations of atrocities and promote accountability for those responsible for atrocities when we see evidence that they've taken place. U.S. State Department spokesman Matthew Miller said regarding the situation in Karabakh. A determination regarding genocide or ethnic cleansing is based on a deliberate, evidence-based process. It's not something I can speak to with any degree of finality from this podium, said Miller. We don't know. I don't think any of us can say whether what percentage of those plan to remain in Armenia permanently, what percentage of them may want to come back, if the conditions allowed. We are reiterating our call for an independent international monitoring mission that would provide rights and security for ethnic Armenians, particularly for any of those who wish to return. Azerbaijan has made those assurances. We think there ought to be an international monitoring mission there to observe and guarantee them, he added. Talking about the situation in Karabakh, Miller said the US welcomes the UN mission in the region. We continue to work with our allies and partners about what a more long-term mission ought to look like. We believe that they ought if they wish to return, they ought to have their rights respected. We encourage Azerbaijan and Armenia to return to peace talks.